This story is sponsored by SC Needs Help. Well, thanks so much for joining us today on Living Local Carolina. Today, I have the treat of being joined in studio by Philip from SC Needs Help. How you doing, man? Hey, how are you? Thanks I'm for having me. I'm doing great. All right, tell me all about what you guys do. Your biz This was founded in 2018, but it's really turned into something much bigger Yeah, SC Needs then. Help um, really started as helping out the flood victims. Uh, in the big floods of 2018, we started off with a warehouse and just getting gear for people and equipment and food and you know uh, non-perishable items that they needed. And it's morphed into something much bigger than that. And now we're just trying to help people year round, not just when there is um, a big event. Mm, I love it, adapting to whatever people need Absolutely. at the given time. So what's on the docket? Uh, in March, it's a great event, raises uh, most of the money for the year. Um, our president, Andy Kemp, just does a really good job at it. He's a barbecue connoisseur. And so mm. he kind of created the event and um, we started out raising money for, uh, for people in need. And now we use this event to fund our entire year. So give me kind of an idea of what you guys do with the funds that you receive. Well, just in the past year, we have adopted 50 kids from the Angel Tree Program. So we're gonna take care of 50 kids for Christmas 2023. And we have sent a family to Disney. Their uh, father passed away uh, unexpectedly. We sent the family to Disney. We purchased a vehicle for somebody that was in need out in Conway. So we just, uh, whatever we can do to help, there's little things that you can do to help people to change their lives drastically. And as a community, we're able to do that uh, as a team. What has been the most memorable moment for you? I think for me, um, the first smoke out at the boathouse was for Andre Pope. And Andre was uh, diagnosed with cancer and he was able to enjoy that event before, um, before unfortunately he passed away. But he was able to be there, shake people's hands and see the event in action, which I think that is really, uh, that's really important. Just a very special moment and a life changing moment for me as well. I was going to say, if somebody's watching this right now and wants to help out, wants to get involved, how can they do that? Go on the web, scneedshelp.org. That will take you to a donations tab or a contact tab and just send us a message and we'd love for you to get involved.